Hi guys, it's Matthew here. Sorry my camera froze for a, little, for, for a minute. Um, so... Sorry guys, my... Sorry, my camera froze again. So... Froze again! Alright. Hopefully it doesn't freeze again. There we go. So, um, sorry about that though guys, but... Um, so not too long ago... Um, I posted, um, uh, um, so seven hours ago, I posted day two in the LEGO Star Wars Advent Calendar. This is who we got in there, is a little, um, clone, um, captain, as a matter of fact. So, make sure to go back and watch that, because that was the last video I posted, as a matter of fact. But, but, we're, I'm not going to be doing any Advent Calendar related stuff today. Um, that was just a quick little... Um, thing to say that um, that this is my second video for today and into and for this video guys I did recently finish Andor and I did watch the latest series the and I did also watch the other latest series um the um tales of of the Jedi as a matter of fact I and so and so today here in this video guys I'm gonna give I'm in, I'm gonna be giving you guys my thoughts on those two shows as a matter of fact guys and so um and and so and so yeah guys um let me know in the comment section down below what did you think of Andor and um and what did you think of Tales of the Jedi and without any further ado guys if you guys can please like comment and subscribe and share this video with your friends that really help out my channel greatly and also guys those of you that are and those of you that are new to the channel, I also do I do more than just movie related content. I also do Lego related stuff and video games, all sorts of stuff like that, guys. So if that kind of stuff is your speed to watch on YouTube, guys, please do go watch a couple of my other videos. Get a couple of my other videos with chance, guys. And if you do end up liking this channel, guys, please do give this video a big huge thumbs up. Leave a like and a comment as a matter of fact, guys. And also guys um, and please make sure you hit that subscribe button, make it gray, not red. And most importantly, guys, please do press that notification bell so you don't miss a single upload in the future, not a single upload in the future, as a matter of fact, guys. And, and also, guys, those of you that are, those of you that are not new to the channel, if you haven't subscribed already, please go subscribe right after this video guys so without any further ado guys enjoy what I say about them it's um um enjoy what I say about them as a matter of fact all right so so um so if um so if I'm too hot so if I don't like um one of one of these two shows guys and if you like it that is that is okay enjoy um enjoy it for yourselves as a matter of fact guys but but I wanted to start with Tales of the Jedi. Like, um, like, um, like, I really loved this show. I'm actually looking forward to seeing if they'll do Lego sets for this show in 2023. Because if they ever do um, a, um, a Dooku versus Yadel, I um I I will be picking that set up as well, guys, and so, and so yeah, I actually really enjoyed um this show. Like um, like I was not real huge about the first episode, but and, um but it was um, it was good. But obviously, um um there was a little bit of um there was a little bit going forward th further with some, with some of the episodes, and so. The first two episodes are supposed to take place before the Phantom Menace. Um, the next two, well, well, the third episode is supposed to take place during. Um, well, the third episode is supposed to take place during the Phantom Menace, and then the fourth episode is supposed to take place just after the Phantom Menace and before Attack of the Clones. So it's in the middle of those two. And then the um, fifth episode is it, um, is supposed to take place after Attack of the Clones, and then the sixth and final episode is supposed to take place after Revenge of the Sith, as a matter of fact. And so, 
And so, um, is and so one thing I do like about Star Wars is that you learn the timelines in order. And Tales of the Jedi kind of kind of had multiple timelines. Like some of it were supposed to take place before any of the prequel movies started, and then during some of the prequel movies, and then after the prequel movies. As a matter of fact, so I I did um. I did like I did like how they do how they did that as a matter of fact. However, I kind of wish they had um they had more dialogue to it and more of a storyline. I kind of wish the episodes were longer as a matter of fact, but that was the only complaint I had about them, but um but other than that, I really enjoyed um Tales of the Jedi and um and a prediction um, that that um that you that um that um that that a lot of people were right about is that um is that Dooku kills Yadel, as a matter of fact. I was waiting for that to happen, as a matter of fact. So those are my thoughts on Tales of the Jedi. Now let's talk about Andor. So Andor is up there with the Rebels, as a matter of fact. I didn't enjoy the Rebels, but Andor was much better um, um, than the Rebels, as a matter of fact. But the reason why I didn't enjoy um, Andor is is because it was a lot different from um, um, from the um, from the other Star Wars shows that they did because. It wasn't a hero's journey. There's no lightsabers or anything like that. And so it's um and so it's kind of it's kind of the most not entertaining thing in a way. And it um it just um it just kind of bugged me as a matter of fact. There's um it's I wouldn't say it's bad, but I did but but I am gonna be real here. I did not enjoy enjoy it as much as the other Star Wars TV shows, as a matter of fact. And so it's just um and it um it was it was it was a little bit upsetting too, in my opinion. And it um and it um and it didn't and it just didn't appeal to me. Like um, like um, like some of the other Star Wars TV shows did. Like Obi Wan, I I enjoyed. Um, the um, the Book of Boba Fett wasn't too terribly mad, bad. I didn't really like the Rebels, but I loved the Mandalorian, the Clone Wars, and the Bad Batch. Like, like I have a huge obsession with the Bad Batch. I really did enjoy the Bad Batch, as a matter of fact. But anyway, guys. Those were my thoughts on Tales of the Jedi and um and 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 or as a matter of fact though guys but but um share your thoughts about these two shows down in the comment section down below guys and I'm hoping the very next Star Wars series spin-off that they do will be better like I'm I'm still waiting for a, I'm still waiting for the series about Ahsoka to come out I don't know when that's going to happen like um like i'm like i'm su i'm super hyped for the next couple of star wars tv shows that they do as a matter of fact though but but so yeah guys um if you guys can please like comment and subscribe and share this video with your friends i really help out my channel greatly and also guys um, those of you that are new to the channel, I do more than just movies and physical media related content. I also do Lego related stuff, video games, all sorts of stuff like that, guys. So if that kind of stuff is your speed to watch on YouTube, guys, please do go watch a couple of my other videos. Get a couple of my other videos chance, guys. And if you do end up liking this channel, guys, please do give this video a big, huge thumbs up. Leave a like and a comment, as a matter of fact, guys. And also, guys, please do consider hitting that red subscribe button make it gray not red guys and most importantly guys please do press that notification bell so you don't miss a single upload in the future as a matter of fact guys and also guys 
Um, those of you that are not new to the channel, and if you haven't subscribed already, please go subscribe right after this video, guys. Without any further ado, guys, take care, drink water, stay safe. I'm going to go get bring you back to more videos because more are on the way sooner rather than later, guys. And I will see you all tomorrow for day three in the LEGO Star Wars Agman Calendar, as a matter of fact. Bye.